A perplexing question has recently surfaced, inciting intrigue and confusion within the spiritual community. Many spiritual guides, those revered individuals committed to the path of healing, have chosen to receive and promote the COVID-19 vaccine. This has left many baffled, prompting us to question the inherent principles that govern our spiritual journeys. It is generally believed that the pillars of free will and personal beliefs should be honed and refined over years of channeling, akin to the river that gradually shapes its path through the persistent erosion of the land. However, this journey isn't uniform for everyone, it largely depends on the depth of the bond between the master and the student, the guide and the trainee. Throughout my spiritual exploration, I've encountered mediums and channels that exclusively serve their clients without questioning their spiritual guidance system. This observation leads me to reassess the level of harmony, connection, and authenticity between the channeler and their spiritual guides. Nevertheless, amid this spiritual inquiry, we must recognize the supreme concept of free will. This principle is as fundamental to our existence as the air we breathe. Unless an individual fully immerses themselves in the channeling experience, the guiding light cannot cross the remaining boundaries. Though invisible to the naked eye, these boundaries are natural and serve purposes beyond channeling. The path of channeling isn't a mere choice, it's a commitment to the soul's journey. Moreover, it's crucial to understand that the path of service to others differs from the path of service to self. These are two journeys, each with unique challenges, rewards, and teachings. This subject is as vast as the universe itself, and while I've touched upon it in the past, I will momentarily pause here. In conclusion, as we navigate this intricate dance of life, we must remember that every path is unique, and every choice is a testament to our individuality. While we can observe, learn from, and draw inspiration from others, we must respect each soul's autonomy and freedom on their spiritual quest. After all, our diverse experiences color the universe's canvas with vibrant hues of enlightenment, 